In an emotional turn of events, Princess Catherine was moved to tears after her husband, Prince William, revealed the poignant reason behind his absence from the highly anticipated Paris 2024 Olympics. The revelation came during his visit to Bertley Community Pool, where the prince candidly opened up about why he stayed behind, while Princess Anne and the Duchess of Edinburgh represented the British royal family in the stands. Speaking with British Olympians Adam Peaty, Tom Dean, and Paralympians Maisie Summer-Newton and Louise Fitz, William addressed the elephant in the room when asked by Tom Dean, Did you manage to get out? The Prince William's response stunned those present and shed light on a deeply personal chapter for the royal couple. No I was so keen to come but I have to say after reading someone's interview about Covid, looking at Adam Peaty, who tested positive during the games. I decided, because my wife was obviously having chemo, that I didn't want to risk bringing Covid home. With his wife, Princess Catherine, undergoing chemotherapy at the time, William's top priority was her health. So Adam very kindly reminded me that that was still a thing. But we watched the whole thing. We were glued to it every day. His words revealed the painful reality of balancing his public duties with protecting his beloved wife, Princess Catherine, as she bravely battled cancer. Despite missing the event, William and Catherine made sure to send their heartfelt congratulations to the athletes through a video message that was later released, featuring celebrity cameos from David Beckham and Snoop Dogg. For William and Catherine, who have always been known for their love of sports, the decision to stay behind was not an easy one. The prince, who has been an advocate for swimming and water sports, shared a touching family story during his visit to the community pool. Catherine and I both adore swimming. George loves scuba diving. He was 10 years old, we took him under, thinking he'd freak out, but he absolutely loved it. It's just introduced him to the world of water, he shared, hinting at the adventurous side of the young Prince George. Catherine's love of swimming is no secret either. She's openly discussed her passion for cold water swimming, a hobby she took up to stay active and healthy, even during her treatment. Fans were delighted to hear her speak about it in a 2023 episode of The Good, The Bad and the Rugby podcast, hosted by her cousin-in-law, Mike Tyndall. The royal couple even showcased their diving skills during a stunning dive at Belize's Barrier Reef during their Caribbean tour in 2022 footage of which was later released by Kensington Palace. During his visit to Bertley Community Pool, William also emphasized the importance of swimming as a life-saving skill, especially in the wake of a troubling statistic. Nearly one in three children in the UK leave primary school unable to swim. Recognizing this gap, the Royal Foundation of the Prince and Princess of Wales announced a transformative partnership with the pool, aimed at offering swimming lessons and activities to over 16,000 people every month, including 6,500 children. This new initiative will help foster a love for swimming among children and ensure they're equipped with the vital skills needed to stay safe in the water. The project, which is close to both William and Catherine's hearts, will give more young people the chance to thrive in the water, just as their own children, George, Charlotte, and Louis, have. The royal couple's continued dedication to supporting sports, health, and education sends a powerful message, even in the most difficult of times, they remain committed to their public duties and the well-being of future generations. For Catherine, who is now in recovery, Seeing the fruits of their foundation's work is a testament to the strength and resilience she's shown throughout her battle with cancer.